All right, here I'm going to show you how to solder a wire onto a switch, which you'll have to do if you're working building circuits. So first I got to make sure I have my goggles on for soldering. I've already stripped the wire about an inch back, and whenever you're going to solder a wire onto a switch or some other piece of metal, you want to make sure as, much, as often as you can to try to tie it on tightly before you even solder it, because you want to make a nice tight connection. So I've twisted it onto one of the poles of the switch, and then I'm going to take my soldering iron and my solder in my other hand, and remember that the first thing you do, you don't, a lot of people do this and they want to drip balls of solder and melt the solder and have it drip on there. You don't want to do that. First you might need to make sure your tip is kind of clean and keep a clean tip so you have a damp sponge nearby and you clean your tip and just make sure it's kind of clean. Then you hold it on the joint to be soldered for about five seconds or a little more until it gets really hot. Then you poke your solder on and the solder itself will melt. And it's being a little stubborn here but there it goes. You don't need too much, just enough to coat the joint and coat the wire a little bit. Blow on it and cool it. Put your soldering iron back and then just 